Unbelievable images tonight out of Oregon City where we're learning about an incredible rescue. A man was inside a motorhome. This was late last night when a massive oak tree came crashing down right on top of him and his daughter watched this whole thing happen. Fox 12's Camilla Ortiz joins us live with a story you'll only see on 12. Camilla, you spoke with this man, you spoke with his family. Just an incredible story. It truly is, Bonnie, unbelievable. And this is the big tree behind me we're talking about. It's hard to really capture the size of this thing. This is the top of the tree, so I was going to just walk next to it here so you can see the size of this thing just completely coated in ice. That's why it, got, it came down, just couldn't take the weight. Look, crushed this SUV here as well, completely smashed. And you can see if we focus in on the root ball here right next to the house, it actually brought up part of the siding here, broke the side of the house, and then, of course, the big story here landed on top of this motorhome with a man inside. Carolyn Buswell and her husband Mark watching and listening to the ice storm taking down trees late Friday night from their front porch in Oregon City. It was like war zone. It really was. Buswell heard one more crack. It just went. It really wasn't much warning. And watched as their 100 foot oak fell right on top of her father's motorhome where he was watching TV. I just heard this ho horrible roar sound. Richard Zornado tells me he was in this red chair when it all came crashing down. Uh, I was pinned in the seat, for, uh, but uh, there was enough give. I was able to slide out of it. Buswell jumping into action so fast to save her 81 year old dad. She didn't even put on shoes. I climbed up the tree up the root ball and and it was icy and I walked up to here. I had been screaming, screaming for him. And when she heard him screaming back, Buswell says nothing can truly describe the feeling. Disbelief, just absolute joy. So thankful my dad was alive. A window that popped out from the impact, giving Buswell a hole to get into the trailer and slide her dad out. She believes this awning helped guide the trunk a few critical inches to the side. I think if it would have been a foot closer with this knot here, he would have died. Just hard to wrap your mind around something like that. Now, Richard was taken to the hospital right away. He was checked out, but incredibly was able to walk away without any serious injuries. Actually, he's been home back here at home with Carolyn for most of the day. She told me the main reason she wanted to do this story tonight was to remind people life is precious and take advantage of all the time you have with your loved ones. Reporting live tonight here in Oregon City, Camilla Ortiz, Fox 12 Oregon.